We are giving our kids one of their Christmas presents early. Is that they're gonna open the garage like this and just see him standing there. Three, Three two, two, one. Today is gonna to be a great day because we are going to do our last big fall activity before we start transitioning to Christmas. So we are kind of finishing up some of our fall stuff. In fact, I threw away like half of our pumpkins, but I have this good idea. What if I set out a tarp and I let my kids just like go ham on the pumpkins? We're winding up fall is what I'm trying to say. And the way that we are doing that is going to be so fun. Every year on this vlog, we have done a fall scavenger hunt. I don't think we've missed a year. And I love that I like have the same activity. I can go back and watch my kids grow as they get older and do it. The exciting part about this is that we are giving our kids one of their Christmas presents early because there's gonna be snow, it's gonna be freezing, and they won't be able to use it when they first get it. So we got them two smooth sat scooters. <laughs> these are and this like muted soft pink this is like a matte it is so cute Beck and we got black they are gonna be so excited I'll show you some of the features later but like it glows in the dark when I give it to him I'm going to like turn off the, the lights and have him go into the room and have like have it all the lights going it's really cool it has adjustable speeds three adjustable heights we are going to go do our fall scavenger hunt tradition. Only this time we are showing up with the smooth sat scooters and doing it in a little bit more of a flare with a little bit more style. Hey, that's not yours. Rocco. Rocco. That's not yours, little love. Okay, so this is what we're gonna use. What they have to find is a little bit shorter than what we've done in years past. Because in years past, I found that it's fun for the first 10 things and then after that, not so much fun. <laughs> So the kids will be home any minute and I'm hoping to have the scooters just ready and waiting for them. All right, I have them waiting right here. My picture, like my, what? The dream is that they're gonna open the garage like this and just see them standing there. That's that's the goal. Crossing our fingers that that's how it works out. How was your guys' this day? Good. I missed you. I get a hug I from anyone? Like somebody like a big dog's gonna come and tackle me. Because she can tell something's up. I never meet them out here on the street. Yes. Well, something is actually up. You guys have been so good this year. We've got something for you to see. Three, two, one. <laughs> what are you guys seeing? Look at it. Are those so cool? And it's not just any electric scooter. You guys, this thing can go up to 10 miles per hour. It has three different seats. We can change the bar in case you want to let a friend borrow it or something. And look at the lights. Look at the lights on the side. Oh, right here, look, so right cool. along the bottom. Isn't that so cool? Right wow. You wanna ride it right now? Okay, get your helmet on, you guys can go ride it right now. Okay, so you get kind of get going, you kind of scoot, scoot, and then you push this, and once you're going, woo! Good, pedal, pedal. Good, and then you push the gas. Wow, you're doing so cool. Wow. Just change the back down to the E mode. So that means it can only go a max of five miles per hour. This day keeps on getting better and better because we are gonna go on a, a scavenger hunt with our new electric scooter. It is definitely time to say goodbye to fall. But are you kidding me, Mr. Lumberjack baby hat? This is so cute. You guys, the first thing we need to find is a pine cone. Homer, we're looking for a pine cone. Can you help Mama find a pine cone? I found them. Oh, yeah. Homer found them. They're up in the tree. Perfect, then we don't even have to worry about taking it home and me sneaking and throwing it away later without you guys knowing. Look, I see a little eeny teeny baby one. He's so cute. Look how cute that is. Oh, we need a yellow leaf, an orange leaf, and a brown leaf. Beckham is two for two. So the only other color we need is a yellow leaf. I found a yellow leaf. Good job. The next thing is a black bird and a bird's nest. Okay, ready? We're bringing in Brie. One, two, three, break! 
Wild berries? Oh, those are some wild berries. I don't know what kind they are. Don't eat them. Very hard time with the birds. Apparently they have all gone south for the winter because I'm seeing zero birds. You didn't see a blackbird? Yeah. You didn't call it, that was on our list. He did. He did. Blackbird. Oh, yeah, he, I, they did, they did see a blackbird. Okay, yeah, it is, I mean, she found a wildflower technically. It's a dead wildflower, but they didn't qualify themselves. Yeah. What do you think, should we count it? Yeah. yeah. Dead wildflower. Think of them leaves, Rocco. What do you think? Palmer's found a stick. Oh, oh careful, we're gonna whack our brother with a stick. What does this remind you of? There's a movie, a Disney movie. What does that remind you of? You guys comment below. And Peyton's hanging out over there on Pur Love Hill. It says propose here. I wonder how many people have actually proposed there. Peyton, are you just waiting for some handsome gentleman to sweep you off your feet? No. Good. That is no. the right answer. I see a little bird's nest up there, sort of. <laughs> if you close one eye and kind of squint and are okay with lying, you found one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> High five. That's exactly what we were looking for. Well, it included some tweaks this year, but I'm glad we did the fall scavenger hunt just so we can say we've done it every year, right? Like, it makes my heart happy. So, fall scavenger hunt, a big check mark. As long as you consider, what did we say? Squinting, closing one eye, squinting with the other, and being okay with lying. We found everything, so there you go. Now it's off to dance for this girl. Hi. We've got homework. And hopefully dad will be able to join us here soon. Yeah. We couldn't get those blackbirds before. There is a lot of blackbirds in the sky right now. Can you see them? Like a hundred birds. They're like, just in case you missed us. Good job, you found that. Good job, Sister Sue. That was new, really good. I would give my new scooter 10 out of 10. <laughs> you would? I'm so glad to hear it. We gave it a million out of a million. Wow. wow, those are some good reviews. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. I love the lights, are you kidding me? So I'm really sad, but I missed uh, because of meetings and things. So now Peyton and I are gonna go on a little ride. I might hop on Beckham's. We'll see. But anyway, it is so cool. So cool. Guess what we're doing by the light of the Christmas tree. Anybody wanna guess? Wanna guess? You wanna guess? I know you do. We are watching Elf. We are watching Elf. And I Palmer and Rocky are asleep. And I have um, Peyton's apparently so, reading a no. really long book. Yeah, no. It's guess how many pages there? How many? One 214. You have the hiccups. Yes, I, do. <laughs> I can tell my level of tiredness by how my body is reacting, right? In fact, okay, I'm on day three of the protocol. We even talked about this today. I feel really tired, but I feel more in tune with my body, and I can tell I'm exhausted. I can feel it in my cheeks. Like, I just feel tired. So, I'm probably gonna fall asleep. I'm gonna brush my teeth before we start the movie. Are you recording me? No. You little stink. You're taking pictures of me? No, he's, he's trying to be a level. Looks like I'm on the camera twice. It's like Inception. So with that, I will link for you below the scooters that we got today. We absolutely love them. So fun spending that time with kids. And I can't wait for lots more fun times to go. So I will link them below. Thank you for being here. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.